Today we're taking a look at Jerusalem artichokes. Rebel canners teaching all kinds of food preparation, especially the old ways. This edible perennial is hardy to zone three, which makes it great for growing in the north. Jerusalem artichokes come in a wide variety of colors, from purples to yellows. The flowers of the plant resemble tiny little sunflowers. Sunchoke plants can grow between four foot 11 and nine foot 10 inches tall. They attract a lot of natural pollinators. Jerusalem artichokes have a nutty taste. They sort of resemble water chestnuts. In the fall, you dig up the tubers just like you would a potato. Be sure to leave some when you harvest so they'll come back year after year. Once established, sunchokes will provide you with a nice harvest every year. Jerusalem artichokes can be grown from seeds or tubers, but the best crops come from tubers. Be sure, whichever way you're going to cook them, that you scrub the Jerusalem artichokes thoroughly. Sunchoke tubers can be eaten raw, cooked, or pickled. Boiling and discarding the water is said to help with the gassy, decreasing the gassy effects from the inulin found in sunchokes. They are delicious and have a nice nutty flavor when roasted. They can be baked in the oven, served just like mashed potatoes, and used to make a delicious soup. You can even deep fry them and make them into chips. Like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell. So many more episodes in this series, you don't want to miss a one.